Hi there, Gail at Seattle Coffee Gear. And what are we doing today? We're in the lab. We call this lab when we're experimenting. So we're going, we, we had a customer uh, write in and ask us if we would try this because he gets this at his local cafe down in Texas. So we said, what the heck? We're gonna do a 30 gram pour over on the coffee we have in here. And you can see the coffee through there. We are using the Ladro Classic today. We're going to let it bloom for 30 seconds, and then we're going to fill it up to the appropriate spot the rest of the way with cold water, like you would a typical pour over. Then we're going to stick it in the fridge, and we're going to let it sit for 12 hours or so, minimum 12, and we'll get back to it and see what it tastes like. You ready? I should have on my lab coat with the pocket protector and the glasses. Okay, I got a scale here so I can. Oh, 30 right on. That never happens. So then we're going to do a 30 second. 30 seconds, and I have it right here. Meanwhile, we're using the Hario, like I said. We love the Hario pour, uh, cold brew, not pour over, cold brew. It's the 60 milliliters, it's the smaller of the two. They're very affordable. They do a nice job. They look good. Everything about them is pretty darn good. Let's see where we're at here. Twenty-eight seconds. We're good. You fill it to about halfway here, up the black plastic sleeve. Okay, I think that's good. Look at it bur bubbling. The air's coming out of the coffee. Boop, 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 boop. Did I ever tell you I was a sound effects person before? No, I'm not. <laughs> All right, caps on, in the fridge. We'll be back in 12 to check it out and see what it tastes like, see if we notice any difference. Okay, here we are, 20 hours later. And I'm just that much older now. Mm. Anyway, doesn't matter. I got coffee. So we did the uh, pre-infusion with hot water, brewed it down with room temperature water the rest of the way, left it overnight. Let's see what it tastes like. We actually put it in the fridge. Looks nice and clean. Not too bad. Not that that would change with hot and cold, I don't think. Mm, that's nice and smooth. That's that's a good cup. It's very good. I would say um, this is the Ladro Classic, by the way, a local roast. I would say maybe it pulls out a little more flavors with the hot, a tad more. I'm getting a little more um, different notes in this coffee than I might with it with the with it not having that pre infusion. But hey, it's very subjective. All this kind of stuff. But thanks for the tip. Uh, our customer down in Texas wrote in and asked us to do this, and we did it, and pretty good. Leave some comments down below. Try it at home yourself. See what you think. Let us know what your outcome is. Have a good day.